Alright friends, if you are frustrated with the new Windows 8 because it does not come with a start button and it's annoying having to go to this screen tile here and you don't like it, don't worry, you can get that start button back and there is an alternative here. Okay, and I'm going to show you how to get that start button back and make it look like Windows 7 or Windows XP again. So let's go ahead and go to the desktop. And uh, we're going to go ahead and use the internet on the desktop. I recommend you use this uh, Internet Explorer here instead of the one on the tile view. So go ahead and open up the Internet Explorer. And let's go to Google.com. Do a search for classic shell and click on uh, the first search result here. Welcome to Classic Shell at ClassicShell.net and click on the green download button here. So wait a few seconds and the download should start. So you're going to get a message at the bottom here. Go ahead and click on run. And it's going to take a couple seconds here to download it. And it's going to run on, on its own. Okay, should be done here in just a second. And it's going to come up with this screen here. Go ahead and click Next. Accept the terms and conditions and click Next. Click Next again. And then click Install. A security warning might come up. Go ahead and click Yes on that. It'll start to install it. Uncheck the View Readme File checkbox and then click Finish. And voila, if you look on the bottom left-hand corner, it appears to be a start button. That looks a lot better, doesn't it? And um, if you notice, it says Windows 8 Pro here on the side. It tells It's going to tell you what operating system you're running. And it looks just like the start button that we're used to. And that's how it, this is how it should be. Okay. And right here you have your programs. With administrative tools, you can go to the Classic Shell folder here and customize it to your liking if you want to. It's going to show you your programs that you have installed. And next on the list is your apps. And so these are the apps that Windows 8 comes with that were on the tile screen on the Start menu. So you can get to those through here. And you can get to your documents through here, your computer settings where Control Panel is, Network Connections, Printer folder here. You can do a search here, and you can also do a search down here in this handy search that we loved back in Windows 7. So you still got that there. And you can shut down your computer a lot faster now. Two clicks, just how it used to be. Start, shut down, or log off. You can also do restart and all the other goodies here. All right, so there you go. We got the start button back. That's how you can get it. Hopefully this has been really helpful to you guys that prefer it the old way. And uh, you guys have a good rest of your day. And thanks for watching.